cruisers, Captain Corey here. Welcome to the Midships channel. And we're doing things a little bit different today. It's a slower cruise news day, but there are some stories we've got to pay attention to. First, we've got the remnants of Hurricane Agatha. It was the first Pacific storm. Well, she's now fully in the Gulf of Mexico, expected to make landfall with the state of Florida on Saturday. So this can and will affect cruises this weekend here that are gonna be planned running through the Gulf of Mexico, Miami, Tampa, Port Canaveral. All of these cruises could be affected, let alone, we don't know what the implications on flights will be as well. So pack your patience if you have a cruise that's going through this part of the world this weekend. Now we're moving on to our next cruise news story, and this is from Carnival Cruise Line. Excuse me while I adjust the gimbal just a little bit here. It's drifting. Carnival Cruise Line is changing the menu for those of you who have food sensitivities or are eating a specific type of diet. They're introducing a new kiosk in all of their eating venues on every ship fleet wide, and this is going to help you track and decide what you can eat. Now, all you have to do when you go in, whether it be the buffet, the main dining room, or any other dining venue on a carnival ship, just let them know you want to use their app to figure out your dietary preferences. All you have to do is put in things that you can't have, and the app's going to tell you what you can eat. Pretty amazing, huh? And one quick thing before I give you the last cruise news story of the day, don't forget my Amazon affiliate store is open for business 24 hours a day, and it's open worldwide. Whether you're here in the US, you're over in the UK, Australia, wherever, it's a great way to support this channel while you gear up for your next cruise. Don't miss out on this cruise duck hunting champion shirt. It's pretty funny. Do you cruise duck hunt? It's one of my favorite pastimes, especially when there's nothing else to do. Now, in our final cruise news story for today, the CDC has come out and issued an elevated travel risk for coronavirus in some popular cruise destinations, Turks and Caicos, as well as Jamaica. So if that's something you're sensitive to and you're booked into either of those areas, well, I'd let you know. Thanks so much for stopping by the channel for this super quick update. I know it's totally different. I'm holding my gimbal, totally strange. You're probably like, Captain Corey, what's going on? You didn't even say, hey, hey, welcome to the Midships channel. Well, I respect your time. And when there's not a ton of cruise news, this is the best way to do it. Thanks so much for stopping by the channel today. And until tomorrow, we'll see ya on the Midships. I don't really have an outro today, so we'll just leave it there. La 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 la